So as I'm sure most of you guys know, back in 2018, 6 9 got arrested on a ton of different charges, and pretty much he's been locked away in jail ever since. We haven't heard a word from him. And with the pandemic that's going on right now, it looks like that's gonna change at any moment now. So if you have no idea what I'm talking about here, 6 9 is a rapper who got arrested back in 2018, and I mean, at one point, it was looking really bad for this guy. There was a chance he was gonna serve life in prison at one point. And pretty much to get out of that situation, 6 9 ratted on everybody involved in the situation. I mean, anybody who was connected to 6 9 that was involved with this criminal activity, they got ratted out by him. He completely complied with the feds and pretty much did anything he could to lower his jail sentence. I mean, he exposed the fact that he would pay gang members to be a part of his music videos. He would literally fund the gang activities so that they would act like he was a part of the gang and be in his music videos. It was pretty ridiculous. And like I said, he had racketeering charges. At one point, I'm pretty sure he even put a hit out on another rapper, Chief Keith. And basically, his expected release date from jail was going to be between July 31st and November 8th of 2020. And pretty much that completely changed this morning when DJ Academics tweeted out that he might get released as early as in a few hours. So here's the tweet from Academics, which says, Breaking, 6 9 is anticipated to be released from prison shortly after his judge and prosecutor both agree that he should be given home confinement to serve the rest of his sentence due to his asthma medical condition during the current outbreak. So pretty much, I, I, have, I had never heard this before in my entire life. I did not know 6 9 had asthma. I don't know, that's just kind of a weird fact there. And obviously, as we know, with the pandemic that's going on right now, it's a respiratory issue, and obviously that's exactly what asthma is too. So pretty much, if Takashi 6 9 ended up getting this virus, that's going on right now, it would be a pretty big problem here. Asthma with a respiratory virus. I mean, that would pretty much be a disaster. And pretty much, they've been making decisions on this all day, and pretty much at this point, it is now gonna be up to the judge to make the final decision whether or not he's gonna be released. And I mean, even if 6 9 does end up getting out of jail today or tomorrow, it's not gonna end well for him. I mean, like I said, this dude has ratted out so many people to get his way out of jail and lower his sentence. I mean, I can guarantee there are probably hundreds of people out there right now that want 6 9 dead. This dude is really gonna have to watch his back once he gets out of jail here. I mean, I can guarantee he's gonna walk out of jail and the first person that sees him is gonna cough on him and he's done for. It's over. Once 6 9 gets out of jail, there's no way he can just walk around the streets like a normal person. Even with bodyguards, there is such a big target on this guy's back. I mean, even before he got arrested and any of this happened, he had been robbed multiple times just being out in public. He's gonna need to, like, get some plastic surgery, change his identity. I, I, I don't, it's just not gonna work out. It's easy going to be in 6 9s best interest to just, you know, buy a house in some remote area and just not tell anybody where he is. I mean, buy a house in Wyoming or something. Who who lives in Wyoming? What even is Wyoming? Anyway, that's where I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this video. Don't forget to drop a like and subscribe if you're brand new to the channel. As always, you can follow me on Twitter at RelaxOnYT. And other than that, I'll catch you guys in the next video. I'm out.